So what about media use, disordered eating, and weight concerns? Internalization of that thin ideal that I talked about has been shown to increase risk for developing an eating disorder. Um, this was established in the Growing Up Today study. You might be uh, familiar with the Nurses Health Study. These are actually the children of the nurses that were enrolled in that study. So it's over 6,000 girls and 5,000 boys. And what they found, if they look in the young people who say that they're trying to emulate a certain look of TV, of media characters, they found significantly more weight concerns and more eating disorder behavior, specifically binging behavior. What about TV time and weight gain? Um, there have been several good studies to show that more TV equals more weight gain. Um, there's not as strong an association between TV time and physical activity, but there have been randomized control trials to show that if you can get kids to watch less TV, they will gain less weight. It's difficult to measure what they're doing when they're not watching TV, but it's certainly something more active than, than this. So how does screen time lead to weight gain? Probably because it discourages nutrition and physical activity. Um, we believe that kids who watch more TV have less active time, especially less time outdoors. Um, studies have shown that the metabolic rate during watching TV is actually lower than sleeping, which is hard to believe, right? Um, I guess at least when you're sleeping, you might toss and turn a little bit, but watching TV, um, kids tend to be very still in the reclined position. Um, dieting and disordered eating um, can lead to weight gain over time. There are longitudinal studies now to show that dieting is a risk factor for weight gain. I try to um, tell the young women that I work with about that because, um, of course, they believe that dieting short term is going to lead to this achievement of the thin ideal and make them happier. But it is, in fact, leads to weight gain over five years. <laughs> 